Hi everyone, welcome to my channel. My name is Kate and today I wanted to talk with you about the ways that we can reduce our environmental footprint by reducing our waste while we're outside of our home. And today I prepared seven items that I think it's really great always to have around, either always with you or just around so you can grab them whenever you might need them. So, let's begin. Number one, that's the, that's the item I think is very useful to have at all times with you and those are reusable handkerchiefs. This one is after my grandpa. Sometimes you can even find new ones in secondhand shops, so definitely check those out. One of the most eco-friendly options because you're not producing anything new. The other option is maybe not as pretty unless you do have time and skills to make them prettier. It's basically a piece of old clothing. Um, this one has a really rough edges, but it works. And when I'm sick, I'm using loads of handkerchiefs, so those comes handy. You don't need too much work in order to make them. And option number three is buying a new one. Uh, I personally have in my shop two of those. They are made out of organic cotton and the thread is also organic cotton, so they are pretty sustainable. They are all fair trade and they are handmade. Um, I have them in pink and in grey, so if you're interested, check them on my website. The item number two, and that's a very important one, I think, because it can be very wasteful, is a, wa <laughs> is a water bottle. And this one is made out of glass. I do have a special case for it, so it's easier to carry around and also protects it pretty well. Uh, I just personally use tap water because it is safe to use tap water around here, but uh, you need to check if it's okay around you. You can also get filters um, and reduce your waste tremendously. Another and lighter option is a stainless steel bottle. Um, they have plenty of those. They work really great. They're much lighter and well, you don't have this worry that they might break. But there's plenty of other options, so just find whatever you like most. And now another thing that is really great to have with you at all times um, is just simple tote bag that you can basically get from any shop. This one is from a vegan shop from Berlin. They're really great if you need to get some groceries or you need to pack something when you add your friends, they want to give you something, you can always pack it in those. They're very light and very durable and you can wash them and reuse them as many times as you want which is really great instead of using plastic bags. And the one that I find really helpful to have around all the time, but you really don't have to, you can take them only when you go shopping, um, are small produce bags. And also I have this like bigger one for bigger items, if you ever feel like they're all mesh and they're very nice. So those will help you reduce your waste while you shop. And now the next items are strictly for when you go out to eat or to drink. Uh, so number one are uh, reusable napkins. Those are made from, I think, upcycled linen. You can make them again from anything you want. You can buy new ones, whatever suits you best. Uh, another thing is a reusable box. I have two types. I have like this tiffin. It has like three different layers or a flat one. Um, it's really great. Several times when I took this one um, to some food events or whatever and uh, very often I'm getting discounts and I don't know it just sparks a conversation with the person that is making the food and selling the food and with other customers and it makes that really really nice because people become more aware and yeah we're reducing waste very very much you can find again plenty of options on the internet this ones I have are from the from the German brand I'm not sure if they're available anywhere else so they probably would be useful for you unless you're from Germany, but otherwise there is just plenty of those. So definitely have this at hand whenever you are planning to eat out. And as we are talking about lunch boxes, another thing are um, reusable cutlery. Those ones you can get anywhere. Those are uh, to go wear. And uh, packaging, I think it's from, made from recycled bottles. And then inside you have um, knife and the spoon and the fork and chopsticks made out of bamboo. I added to it also that's like an extra item you can have. They are not necessary. However, I found it very useful to have them at hand when I eat out, especially in a country that I don't speak the language of. Show them this and then they usually remember not to bring uh, another straw. So that is very useful in my opinion. And the last option is uh, to have a reusable cup. 
Uh, I'm whenever I just go out and I want some tea, I just bring my mason jar. But you can really get any other jar, or you have those special coffee cups that will be better protecting from heat because that's not really the best. Um, but anyways, they are great uh, and reduce waste a lot. Most of those one-use cups are not recyclable and usually go to waste. So please make sure you do bring a reusable option. Even if something is recyclable, it's still better to use a reusable one. And first of all, it takes a lot of resources to recycle them. And then they still cannot be recycled forever. At some point, they will need to, to end up in the landfill. Um, so it's always best to use the reusable option and reuse them as many times as possible until they break. And as the planet is in a very bad state right now, it's very important to actually do all we can to save it. So yeah, that's my tips for today. There are going to be way, way, way more of those coming up. Uh, if you enjoyed this video, please make sure you subscribe to my channel and click the notification button because, yeah, as I said, there'll be a lot of those coming up. Um, and yeah, give it a thumbs up, comment down below, do all of that stuff. That Let me know that you enjoy this content. If you want to like read through all of that again, uh, you don't want to rewatch it, you prefer to read, you can find the same content on my website that is linked up here or in the description down below. And yeah, that's it for today. Thank you so much and see you in the next video. Bye.